darkness. What's up everyone, for the last time, I'm Dick Machinko. Welcome everyone, welcome to the stream on a Monday no less. What's going on? Where's Brian? This is stupid. God, on a Monday? Are you joking? Good afternoon everybody, welcome. Thank you Stephen for the resub, 25 months. Oh boy, a resub. Yes, please. Another lovely month with the best community, the best boys, even though they've been away. Yeah. And numerous fun moments. I've begun pre-production on the best of Triple Jump 2021 video, and there's so many. Lots of love to you all. Thank you, Stephen. Thank you so much. Welcome, everybody. Hope you're well. Hope you had a nice weekend. Did much happen yesterday? I don't think so. Not as far as I'm aware. Um, we're going to be playing a bit more Pokemon today. That there, Pokemon Fire Red, but it's a mod. We're playing Pokemon Ash Grey. We're going to play a little bit more. A little bit more, see how we get on. Perhaps decide whether or not we just abandon it and never come back. We'll see. Yeah. We'll see. Hello, Richard Maichinko. How was your weekend? Very excited to see you. Had these extra bits because you and Brian have done a brilliant job on the channel this past month. I sadly will be at work during Brian's stream tomorrow, so do pass along the message. I won't. You guys are brilliant as you continue to be, and I've really enjoyed everything. Big love to you and Brian. Thank you, Stomps. Thank you, Stephen, much, Sovan. Uh, thank you so much for your generosity, Stephen. Really appreciate it, and the kind words. Uh, I, of course, as Dick Machinko, will not miss any of you, because you're all terrible, and I need to go back to space or wherever it is that I'm from. But I'm sure Ben appreciates what you said, and and so on. Thank you so much. Uh, Desi does pizza. Thank you for the resub. 11 months. Oh yeah, here we go. Poking time. Yeah. I've done a poke before. What's up Richard Billy, Richard Batman, Squirtle, Danny, Sidek and Pikachu. Sorry to see you go again, Richard, but the universe needs you. It does. Genuinely does. Mr. Black, thank you so much for the blips. Thank you. Mascot5, thank you for the resub. 15 months. Another month under the belt. Happy freaking days. Very happy. Thank you so much. Rory Seagull, 28 months. Hey, Deke. Sorry to see you go. 28 months of subbing. Dab, dab, dab. Yeah. Dave, Dave. Team 5, Dick salute. Donak, thank you for the blips. Thank you very much. Odi Lazus, 17 months. I'm not ready to say goodbye to you and yet to you and Brian. Please stay. I promise I won't shop you into the Hague for 
for the war crimes what you did. Well, you've got no proof that I did war crimes apart from the ones that I've admitted to, so... Sucks to be you, mate. Thank you very much for the blips. I'm not the blips, the resub, though. Thank you. GY Goliath gifting two subs to the community. Welcome, Jack CJ0712. And thank you for joining us for the first time, by the way. Uh, and also Darkstar Roman numerals. Uh, welcome to the Warriors Clan. Thank you, GY Goliath, for your generosity. Thank you so much. L Baker 97, 22 months. 22 months. 22 months. Thank you. Thank you very much. Batman Van Drew. 26 months and many more with this wonderful channel and community. Oh, thank you, Batman. Fun. Batman fun. Thank you, Batman fun, Drew. Thank you. Okay, so yeah, we're going to play a bit more Pokemon. Um, we're following the events of the anime. We've just arrived back in Cerulean City because there's something going on with Misty and Misty's doing stuff. And I, I can't flip and remember. Anyway, the gloves are com coming off. The gloves are... The gloves are coming off. Catch, Danny. Armadillo87, thank you for the resub. Ten months. Yeah, I could have been a lot better subscriber. I don't think so. I think you've already mastered it, quite frankly. Sammy, what's her name? Six months. Hello, friends. Hope you are all well. Hope you're doing well too, Sammy. Thank you for being here. Thank you for the reset. Danny's fine. He's just... He's fine. He's fine. He's doing okay. Oh, for God's sake, I saw that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Deek my chinko time. That SNES launch game video had me laughing so much and I've watched the video a few times already. It's that good. Excellent job, my dude. It wasn't me, it was Ben. Ben did that. Oh, Big Titty Jesus 42, you can't use my name. <laughs> they, <laughs> they don't like it. Who was it that said that? That was Stephen. Thank you, Stephen, for the blips. It's very kind of you to say. I'm glad you enjoyed the video. Thank you very much. Um, Lolly Lama, thank you for the resub. 20 months, F for Danny. That is a war crime. He's fine, look. He's got hair and everything. He's doing great. Um, let me hop over and read out Big Titty Jesus 42's donation. Bear with me a second. Very nice. Thank you, El Sandy Pants, for the donation there. Big Titty Jesus 42 said, Hey there, Dick. I hope you're doing good. And hi, everyone. Hope you're having a great day. Also, love the gloves. Thank you. They're Danny's now. I think he owns them legally. So yeah. there we are. Eden and Pops, no, you used my name. It counts as a swear word. I don't know why, because it's a name. Hey, Dick, Eden and I... Aiden and... Hey, Dick, Eden and I just wanted to say thanks for the streams this month. It'll almost be a shame to get Ben back. Much love. Much love to both of you. Thank you for the... Thank you for the blips. Right, let's hop over to the video game. Jame, game, Jame, shall we? This button and... There we are. It's dusk. We're in. And it's time to find out what the flip is going on. Yeah. As you get ready to leave for your home planet, always remember to slap Richard my sink ho team five dick salute. Moggy dab 69. Always embalm. Thank you for the blips. Always got to slap Richard. Right. Controller. Hello. Hey. We discovered that the thieves were from Team Rocket. They're always, are there any thieves that aren't a part of Team Rocket? We recovered the goods, but the culprits got away. Oh, man. Huh? My sisters are looking for me? I only came here so my horsey could use the pool at the Cerulean Gym to get some exercise. I wonder what my sisters could want. I guess I better find out. Well, I guess we'd better find out too. Hang on, how are my Pokemon doing? Do they need a heal? No, they're good. Oh, hi, Charvo. Ooh, Charvo. We're putting on an amazing underwater performance. It's called The Magical Mermaid. But if you want to see how... If you want to see the show, you have to buy a ticket. So how about it? Want to buy a ticket to the show? Only $500? Alright. Great. It's a really great show. You'll see. It's great. 
It's about to start, so come on in, quick. All right, in we go. Didn't I get stuck in here before? I couldn't get out. I you remember that. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for your patience. Our underwater ballet, The Magical Mermaid, performed by the exciting and talented Cerulean Sisters, is about to begin. Now presenting our famous underwater star in her glorious return to Cerulean City, Misty. <gasps> Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We're here to haul off all the water Pokemon in the ballet. Let's get this show on the road. Flipping better not. Oh, God, he's so fast. Look. So, trying to steal the show from Team Rocket... Time for the grand final, a Pokemon battle. Alright, well, I think we know how this is going to end, but fair enough. You can try. Oh, yeah, send out the same four Pokemon. Go on, I dare you. Go, wet boy! Those guys should stop trying to do crimes, I agree. It's not working out well for them, is it? Water gun. That'll do. It was effective enough. Mm. Arbok, no. Wet boy's got this. We are getting him to level 69 today. Or we shall die trying. Mm -hmm. Hydro pump. Get him. Flipping get him. I know it's pretty much too late now anyway, but I can apparently add permitted terms to something. Should I try and see what happens when I add dig? Yeah, go for it. I'm wondering if it's more of a Streamlabs thing than a Twitch thing. Because I think you're allowed to type dick in the chat. I can see it. You're all typing. It's there. I think it's Streamlabs that might be having an issue. But we will see. It's my last time, isn't it? So it doesn't even matter. <laughs> I see all the love from everyone and the thank you all very much, but knowing not that Twitch still thinks I'm obscene. Obscene. This is just the only way I can do or say any damn thing. Outrageous. Down with Big Twitch. Thank you, Big Titty Jesus 42 for the second donation, and I hope you're doing well. Get out of here, Arbok. Mm -hmm. Wheezing. More like dead. <laughs> Come back from that, you big loser. Water gun. <laughs> Explosion. Oh, they changed the name from self-destruct, did they? No, 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 no. This poor Lickitung as well, with the world's worst trainers. And now it's dead. Nope, not yet. You slam me. I slam you. That's what, that's what I thought. Shouldn't have messed with Wet Boy. That is what happens every Tim. Looks like the show's over for Team Rocket. <laughs> Our performance was a flop. Team Rocket's blasting off again. Oh, I've got Slack open. I need to turn that off. Bear with me a second. Bear with me a second. Du, 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 du. Bu, 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 bu. What on earth is that? Du, 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 du. Phillips posted a big thing. It's taking up the whole screen. Hang on. Pause my notifications. Two hours. Go away. Stop that. There we are. We're all good. Fixed now. Chavo, thanks so much. Thanks for saving my life. Thanks to you, the audience just loved the underwater ballet. All one of them. I only got roped into this by my sisters. But now that the show was a success, I can continue my own journey. Weird sentence. As my thanks, I want you to have this fishing rod equipped with my very own good luck lure. It will make fishing for Pokemon a lot easier. It's a super rod. My sisters want me to leave my Starmie and Horsey here to perform in the show. I just can't say no. What? What do you mean can't say no? They're your Pokemon. Don't you need them? 
By the way, if you're heading back to Viridian City, you'll have to travel back through Mount Moon. There's no other way to go. Good luck, Charvo. Right, so I've now got a backtrack, have I? The underwater way, the ballet was like a huge success. Now we can keep the gym running and continue putting on performances for our adoring fans. We're the world famous... Yeah, okay. Let's go. Let's go. Don't fall in the pool. Right, so I need to go to Mount Moon now. I'm going to do a little heel. Which is to the left, isn't it? Everything you own in a box to the left. Let's go. So I'm assuming there'll be some sort of story thing that happens. Can I even get to Mount Moon from here? I don't know that I can. Oh, go away, Ratata. We don't have time. I right, definitely can't do it that way. Run away. Just... <sighs> there we go. It's like Rock Tunnel all over again. I can't even... I can. Right. Back to Mount Moon I go, I suppose. Ooh. Protect? Great. Clefairy Thieves, episode 62. Okay, that's where we're going. Thank you, Rory. Hello, there's one. It's a wild Clefairy. What could it be up to? Just existing, like it owns the place. Who does it think it is? What do you... Did it just drop kick me? Huh? Your pickaxe is missing. Clefairy must have stolen it. Choking me? What are you doing? Come back here, you little rascal. Oh, God, this bloody place again. Clefairy. <laughs> Manta Ray Tiger, thank you for gifting five subs to the community. Welcome, Eric the Dead, Silog, Le Legendarius BC, Natmac5, and Blickidi to the Walrus Clan. Thank you, Manta Ray Tiger, very much for your generosity. Right, come on, look, now we're back in a in a cave where we're going to get attacked constantly by level 7 Zubats, and I should have bought some repels, shouldn't I? Are you in here? No. Oh, here we are. There's a rocket ship on the floor. <laughs> Go away, Zubat! Oh my god. I can't even take, I can't even take one step. Charvo! I knew the Clefairy were from outer space. They've built this spaceship. So they can return to the moon. Your pickaxe? Oh, the Clefairy must have borrowed it to burrow through the wall. What is going on in here? They've done it. They've torn through the rock wall. The Clefairy boarded the rocket. The Clefairy are taking off and I'm going to go with them. The rocket is taking off. The rocket exploded out just full stop. The rocket exploded. There were no survivors. The pickaxe fell out the spaceship's door. I don't think things should be able to fall out a spaceship's door. Uh Okay. Now am I done in here? I'm assuming I go through the hole the hole in the wall. I don't know what's going on. This is just bonkers. Get away. Leave me alone, Zubat. You've got to, you've got to stop. Hello? You're not new. I've fought all of you before. Oh, it's safer up here. You won't find any Pokemon. Oh. What did you, what? Let me just. It's safer up here. But you won't find any cave Pokemon. Okay, so it's just regular Pokemon. Brilliant. Um, I've been up here before, haven't I? Am I just... Is this just an exercise in... Like, why am I here? I don't have a repel. I believe me, I would use it if I flipping had one. These bloody Zubats! I'm just going deeper into the cave. What's the point? Hello? Is this new? 
I don't know what's new. Mealy Squealy, thank you for the resub. 26 months. Happy actual New Zealand 420. Blaze extra hard. Thank you, Mealy Squealy. There you go. That's for you. Thank you very much. Okay, yeah, 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 go away. You? I was going to use the HM move flash, but now it wasn't necessary with all the lights strung up. Okay. Am I back in pewter now? Yeah. Yeah. What? I don't really understand the point of that encounter or what I've got to do next. Do I just have to wander around aimlessly until I find out what's going Game, what do you want me to do? You're, bit, you're getting progressively less clear. At the very least, previously, I just had to make my way from gym to gym, and now I've nearly done them all. You're sending me all over the place, and I don't understand. I don't understand. Viridian City now. Okay. Thank you very much. Down we go. Why don't I have any Pokemon that know fly? Can I go around? All right. Let's avoid the woods. <laughs> no one in here. Cool. No. Nope. That's a dead end. And a level two ratatatata. Thank you. What a treat for me. Right, we're in Viridian. I go shopping in Pewter occasionally. I have to take the winding trail in Viridian Forest when I go. Right, this doesn't look ominous. Excuse me, boys. Oh, here he is. It's Senor Joe. Still playing with your cute little pokey pals, eh, Chavo? I thought you finally gave up catching and training Pokemon. I figured you went back to Pallet, but no, here you are, still at it. I just stopped by on my way back to Pallet to see if the leader of this gym wants to battle a real Pokemon trainer. I'm Senior Joe Oak from Pallet. I hereby request a battle with the leader of this gym. Is that it? Is that all it takes? I'll do that. Only one trainer allowed in the gym at a time, kid. The battle's over now, you can enter. Well, there's still two trainers in there, but this one. Oh no, Senor Joe, did you have a fall? It's here. A Pokemon that we've never seen did this. There's something different about this one. This Pokemon's not just powerful, it's evil. One thing's, one thing's for sure. No one will ever beat that Pokemon. Oh god. This better not be Mewtwo. Ha 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 Oh, there they are. Today, something has happened that will make you very jealous. We just got a big promotion. Now we're going to get the respect we deserve. How have you earned a promotion? Because the new leaders of this gym are the three of us. Just moments ago, we were put in charge of this gym and the Earth Badge. If you want it, you'll have to defeat us. Well, it looks like I'm not pressing anything. It's doing this on its own. Let's see just how strong you are, little boy. You know, you know, you know. I've beaten you about 12 times in the past two streams. I beat you about five minutes ago. Well, you got a match amp this time. Okay. These aren't your regular Pokemon. Hydro Pub. Do, 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 do. Kingler. Get in there, pal Musek. That cat gal, thank you for the resub. 20 months. Thank you so much. Do, 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 be, do, 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 do. Thunder. Yes. First try, check this out.
Right on. Get back in there, wet boy. <laughs> A Pokemon we've never seen before. Which one was it? What are they talking about? Oh, wet boy, no! Nice recoil, idiot. Yeah, that's what I thought. Rick drinks beer. Thank you for the resub 14 months. Go, Dick, go! I'm going. There goes Rhydon. Rhygon. That was so difficult. Grr, we won't lose this time. You've just done it. It just happened. Now you have to face Team Rocket's Pokemon. All Pokemon attack at once. For God's sake. Really? You guys, you've got to stop. There's Victory Bell. Here's Wet Boy. Border Slam. These silly rockets, what are they like? Yeah. Monday already team five bender. Team five what, sorry? Ben Bender? It's Ben Doe. Double L loser, thank you for the blips. I know. It was it was Friday. Like two days ago. What's going on? Just, what's next? Choose Tuesday, huh? Absurd. Thank you for the blips. Do do. As adults, why didn't they just attack Charbo and take his Pokemon? It's a great question. I mean, last year we played through the Team Rocket edition mod of this game, and uh, when you beat someone, you did. You stole one of their Pokemon. Don't know why they don't do that. They're a lot bigger and stronger than Charbo is. Don't really understand, but there we are. I bet they give me an Earth badge as well when I beat them. They don't have to, but I bet they will. Do 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 do. Mm -hmm. Do do do. Hydro pump. Pete Smart, 1983, or Pete Smart. Thank you for the blips there. Thank you very much. Do did we just miss that? Okay. Body slam. Do. Rory Seagull, you're, you are the MVP. Pallet Town next. Thank you. We are going to do it, I think. We're about to hit the, the weed number. Get ready. Get prepared. I think it might be about to happen. Body slam. Nice one, lick a tongue, idiot. We won't miss. Body slam. <laughs> Water gun. Come on. Ah, oh, damn it. So close. So close. Oh. Ah. Ugh. My elbow. Oh, you're not getting that Earth Badge twerp. Okay, they're learning how to be criminals. Or, or at least successful criminals. However you choose to define that. Bastards, really. Right, couple of willies. I don't care if it's cheating. We're cheaters. And now, we're going to set off our secret weapon and blow away the competition. Ha 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 Oh god, what is it? James, don't tell me you set the bomb to go off on our side of the gym. Looks like Team Rocket's blasting off again and dying in an explosion. Oh, they dropped the Earth Badge. Easy. Well, that'll do it. Ba -ba -da -ba. Earthquake. Okay, well, great. Nice gym you've got here. I'm just going to go just do a lap. 
just in case. Oh! The building's collapsing, let's run for it! Yeah, just leave me in here, that's fine. I will save, thank you. The Viridian gym is collapsing. Oh my god! That could have been us under that boulder. Well, that's a great ball. I'll put that with my super rod. Right, let's do a save, and then we are down to Pallet Town. Save game. Do 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 do. Jim? James? Not James. Pokemon Center? James is the thing that just fell down. Right, do we have repels in here, please, for the love of God? Oh, they're Ultra Balls. They follow us around. That's nice. Repel, repel. Yes! I'll take 87. I'll take 20. Beep, JT the Destroyer, thank you for the resub. 23 months. Wow, one more month until two years. The time does fly when you're gaming with the boys or girls. Thank you, JT the Destroyer, for being here. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a little shortcut on that one so that, so that I can... No. Access it. No, I can't. I wanted to do it so that when I press the select button, it uses one. No, I'll just use one now. I don't even care. Don't even care. We're off. Actually, I do care. That was a total waste. I was going to go to the Pokemon Center. Where's the Pokemon Center? Oh, what a silly billy. Don't worry. I'm made of money. I'll just buy more. Oh, yeah. The route's different, isn't it? Hello? Oh, God. Yeah, of course. This is where we got struck by lightning with Pikachu and then we stole Misty's bike. I remember. Vaguely. Oh, the rappel wore off. Well, good thing we used that, eh? Do, 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 do. Just in time to hit the grass. Hello? What was that noise? Do you hear like a Pokemon noise when I hopped over? That was weird. Maybe I'm just imagining it. Do, 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 do. Hello? Huh? There appears to be an invisible wall blocking your path. Oh no. Close your eyes. It's a Mr. Mime. It seems to be constructing an invisible barrier. Brilliant. Is that or is that not the one who Ash's mother is in a romantic relationship with? Please stop. Would you please let me capture that Mr. Mime? Poor Mrs. Mime. The Mr. Mime ran away. The invisible wall vanished. Oh no. Now what will I do? My name's Stella and I'm the ringmaster of the Pokemon Travelling Circus. What? The one that we got hypnotised for. My Mr. Mime refuses to perform because of how hard I trained it. So... That's not good. So I thought I might be able to catch another one. I don't know what I can do to inspire my Mr. Mime again. I know. Maybe if you battle with it, Mr. Mime will be inspired to perform again. What? So you're working it so hard it doesn't want to perform. You want me to beat it up so badly that it wants to perform. Is that it? That's what you're suggesting. Let's give it a try. All right. It's Tamer Stella. <laughs> <laughs> is a Mrs. Mime. Um, sorry, sorry, mate, but I do need to get to level sixty-nine. Ah. <sighs> get ready, everybody. We're about to hit the weed number. That's it. This is what we've been working towards. Do, 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 do. It's the weed number, everyone. Sex it. <laughs> well, did it work? Is, is Mr. Mime just dead or is it ready to perform now? What a great battle. Thank you, Chavo. Mr. Mime is inspired to perform again. What? 
now we can return to the Pokemon Circus and put on wonderful shows again. Bye. Glad I could help. What? Mom! I'm home! Ah, oh, there it is. Mr. Mime. Mr. Mime. Oh, Chavo, it's so wonderful to have you home again. And you've earned enough badges to qualify for the Pokemon League, too. Hmm? What Pokemon? Oh, you must mean... Little... Mimey. Your new dad. It ran into our house because it was frightened. At first I thought it was you returning from your journey. Mimey's become like a member of the family already. Oh, flippin' bet he has. It's so nice to have a Mr. Mime around the house to keep me company when you're off on your Pokemon journey. That reminds me, you should go see Professor Oak about entering the Indigo League Championships. I'm so proud of you, Chavo. Oh, by the way, Chavo, you'll be so pleased to know that I bought a warp program. I took the liberty of installing it into your PC. Now you can warp to any Pokemon Center you've already been to in the entire Kanto region. Thank God for that. Isn't science great? You can activate the warp program from your PC in your room or any PC in any Pokemon Center. You don't have to thank me. I was happy to do it. All right. Thanks, Mum. Father. Uh, not a tadpole, thank you for the resub. 11 months had to resubscribe to let you know that I'll miss you, Richard. Oh, I'll miss you too, not a tadpole. See you next year when Ben screws up again. Dead Eye Minis, thank you for the resub. 29 months, another week away from home and more missed streams. But back in time to catch this one and do this. Hope you are well, Deke. Thank you, Dead Eye Minis. I hope the travel isn't too uh, strenuous for you. And thank you so much for all the support. Well, before we talk to Prof Oak, let's see if we can go enter that fighting tournament. You remember the one that we were going to do with Wet Boy? I don't know where it is, though. Oh, ah, no, I wasn't ready. Oh, God, which one is it? Where the hell do you think it is, eh? It's got to be somewhere. It's got to be somewhere around here. I'm going to guess um, Route 69. Yeah. I'm going to guess it was near Celadon. I might be wrong, though. Or maybe closer to... Let's go Saffron. Whip, whip, whip. Hey, guys, don't worry about me. Just got access to that 9,999,999 warp pad. My mum's like a high roller. Don't even worry about it, bro. It's fine. I want to say it's somewhere along here. Pardon me. Big Rocky Mountain. Pardon me. Pardon me. Big old expansive. Absolutely not. Oh, well, there's Celadon, so that was a waste of time. Pardon me, everyone. Excuse me. Do 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 do. What do 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 do. At some point, we're going to be able to climb, and that's going to make all the difference in the world. What was this? Oh, yeah, Cringy City. Yes, here we are. Here it is. We got it. Big Titty Jesus 42, you've donated. Thank you so much. I don't know why. It, did it even pop up with a message once? I don't know why that didn't read out at all. Hasn't even popped up, has it? I'll read it any... Well, you know what? We'll fake it. Bear with me a second. Um, there we go. Wow, John! It's a test donation. This is a test donation for £52. Big Titty Jesus 42, thank you very much for your donation. I don't mean to bring the tone way down, but I saw that Mikey said he got COVID, and I was wondering if you knew how he's doing. I hope he's feeling uh, as well as he can. And again, sorry for dragging the stream down. Don't worry about it at all. This is the first I'm hearing of it. I've been avoiding Twitter recently, which is where I assumed perhaps he was talking about it, but I had no idea. So I know as much as you do. <laughs> I will have to check in on him. Uh, but if you want to... If you want to wish him well, at Parrot Boy on Twitter. Um, but yeah, no, absolutely. I did not know. So I will... <laughs> I will shoot him a message.
I've learned how to remix now. You're all in trouble. Welcome. Ooh, have I just completely destroyed the frame rate? Welcome to the Pokemon number one Grand Prix Championship. I'm sorry, but you can only enter one Pokemon into the championship. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Right, let's do this thing. It's £3.50, not $5 anymore. God, it might be. Can we just stop? Can, can the UK just stop tanking the exchange rate with boneheaded decisions, please? Because it makes my life converting it into dollars very hard. Right, we'll lower the threshold. Bear with me. Fl flipping Brexit, man, I swear to God. Can you, can you not? Can you just not? For like a day? <sighs> Sorry, bear with me. Anyway, we're back. There are clearly, quite clearly, members of uh, Team Rocket in that lineup. I don't know if you spotted them. Doo -doo -doo. It is set to a pound's amount. We have it set to a pound's amount. Um, so I think maybe in this instance, Big Titty Jesus forty D didn't didn't quite hit, quite hit it. But yeah, it's three pounds fifty now. Five dollars US, three pounds fifty sterling. Oh goodness. Okay, right. Everybody but Wet Boy, get out of here. Sorry, this is the Wet Boy show, and you're just along for the ride. Um, right. I can see Jesse and James in there, so we get to fight them again. They're, they've been busy, haven't yeah. they? Yeah. Hashtag Freebsh. What Freebsh? Freebsh. Greg or Monkey, thank you for the very, very generous amount of uh, blips there. Free BTJ. What is that? Is that something I don't understand? How much is it in Brazilian dollars? I have no idea. Uh, knowing the, the power of the sterling, probably not a lot. Oh, free Big Titty Jesus. Okay, gotcha. Thank you. Yeah, careful. Don't type the name out fully or Twitch will ban you for some reason. Ah, so you have a fighting Pokemon. Very well. Let the contest begin. Yes, we're doing it. Haha! -ha! Your first opponent shall be your last. They're all going to be like level 20, aren't they? Massive Mammary Messiah. Yes. Large chested deity. Precisely. Right, Hitoshi, what have you got? What level is it? It's level 20. Would you look at that? Let's just get this done. Bye. Oof, I give up. Oof, I give I guess I'm not P1 material. Mm. Come on, let round two begin. Get out of here. I won't lose. Watch and see. Level 21. Oh, 22. Who are you? Hey, water gun. Bye. Wowee. Du -du -du. You nailed me. I guess I wasn't prepared to be a P1 yeah. champ yet. <laughs> Free big TT Jesus. Oh, got him. Got him. <laughs> Some kind of div. Thank you for the blips. That's how we do it. You spell my name D double E K. And that's how you type big TT Jesus right there. Okay, another another person I've trained for this moment my entire my entire life. Um I'm destined to be the P1 champ. They've been training their entire life. They will have a level 24 Machamp. Their entire life's work, this. It's Aaron. 25. Their entire life's work. And then it's just Water Gun! Ooh! Someone's looking powerful. Did 13 damage. A body slam. <laughs> oh, your entire life. Bud. But my destiny. I must bow to your skills. Well, you can. You didn't bow, so that's fine. Begin the semi final round. Ah, right, here they come, look. We can't wait for the chance to show you, goody goody, what it. To... We can't wait for a chance to show you, goody goody, what a loser you are. 
doesn't really work in that context, does it? But fine. We stole this Pokemon especially to win the championship belt. We're going to be the winners around here. All of the English is slightly strangled. Some of the things they say doesn't really make a lot of sense. It's Team Rocket Cohorts. Hitmonlee. Ooh, level 28 Hitmonlee. Try my level 69 Wet Boy, bro. Can I... Can I hack the game so that my level is permanently displayed at level 69 even when I level up? Because that's uh, what I want, really. Da -da -da -da. I give up. Good job, guys. So who's in the final? We may have lost the fighting tournament, but you haven't heard the last of us. We're blasting off again. Let the finals of the P1 Grand Prix begin. Oh my god, she's floating. He's floating, sorry. So, you made it to the finals, eh? That's pretty impressive, but you won't get any farther. We'll see about that. You bring out your level... Your level 30 Hitmonchan. That's right. I designed this game, apparently. Get wet! A new catchphrase that I've been workshopping. I don't know if it. Get wet! There we go. I can't give you the lottery numbers because I'm using them. I gotta throw in the towel. What do I win? I lost to a worthy opponent. You deserve the P1 Championship, Javo. Now, I can go be with my family and stop all this tough training until next year. Congratulations for your victory in the P1 Grand Prix. Please accept this prize. Black Belt as a, re as a re reward. Chavo put the Black Belt in the item, so it's just going to be some crap boosts fighting moves thing, isn't it? Thank you so much. Now my daddy can be with us as a family again. Oh yeah, I forgot about that subplot. Why is Anthony floating everywhere? I was so impressed with your wet boy. It's got a lot of natural fighting talent. Why didn't you let me train it for a while? I promised to turn it into a real P1 chap. No, what? Hey, I understand if you want to keep it to train yourself. Good luck, Charbo. Yeah, nice try, Anthony. Spend some time with your daughter, Anthony. I need my Pokemon back, Anthony. <laughs> Excuse me. What an arse. Right, let's get our lad out. Do, 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 do. Withdraw. Whoa. Withdraw. 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 Mm -hmm. I'll leave you two. Leave you three to it. Right. Nearest Pokemon Center is probably still this way, isn't it? Whoa. No, 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 no. Do, 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 do. <sighs> Whoa! Shut up and take my money. I love you, boys. Thank you for everything. I sleep all day 21? That's obscenely generous of you. Thank you so much for your donation. Really, really appreciate it. Nobody tell Brian. Because I'm going to take that and run when I leave this week. Thank you so much. That means a lot really does and it genuinely helps and um to give you guys a little timeline update uh i understand that peter and ben will be returning to the office just double check the end of next week things will be Pending everything going big, big mammary gland Jesus up, um, things will be sort of returning to normal soon. Worst games ever face cam on screen at the same time doing streams together. What? What? As if? What? Thank you, everyone, in now a very happy, well endowed chest wise Jesus. You lovely bastards are now worthy. Also, my internet is being stupid slow right one if this happens to come in really late. Cruise you, Comcast. Cruise you! Oh, sorry. 
Cruise you, Comcast. Thank you, Big Titty Jesus. 42. Thank you very much. Okay, our boys are healthy. Let's walk back to Mum's house. We're going to pallet. Yes, I would like to... Whoa! Off we go. Whoop, 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 whoop. Well, thank you. I sleep all day. We promise. It, it will be spent wisely. Oh, God, Mr. Mime. <laughs> Father, no! <laughs> Father, no! <laughs> okay. Uh, Professor Oak. Oh, flipping heck. Here we go. Look. Talk to me. Don't talk to him. Are you here to see Grandpa about the Pokemon League 2, Charvo? Why even bother? There's no way you'll meet me. I think I've beaten you several times, actually, but maybe not. Oh, what a surprise. So you've earned enough badges to... What a surprise. Why is everyone a... just a complete ass to me around here? So rude. Have you seen my wet boy? Hey, Charvo. It just so happens you're not the only Pokemon trainer to show up today. Well now, I'm not surprised you showed up late. I'm surprised you showed up at all. Alright, calm down you two. Why can't Pallet's two top Pokemon trainers get along? That's right, four Pokemon trainers left Pallet Town on their Pokemon journeys, but two of them have died. You and Senior Joe are the only ones left alive, and you've earned the badges. I'm very proud. Jack and John, which I assume those were the other default names, when you uh, when you start a new game in like red and blue, they sound familiar anyway. Got off to an excellent start, but they just died. They just straight Team Rocket murdered them. But Senior Joe has ten badges and jo ten what? Ten badges, and Chavo earned eight badges. That's really quite remarkable. Yeah, because he's he's flip he's invented two of them. Have a look closely. Look, that's a milk bottle cap. What do you what's wrong with you? You're so old. You don't know what you're doing. That's really quite remarkable. That's why I'm glad you're here. It's time for you and Senior Joe to participate in the Pokemon League. The Pokemon League meets the same place every year, atop the Indigo Plateau. Or when I was a child playing Pokemon Blue, I thought it was the Indigo Plateau. Which isn't, which isn't far off. The tournament hasn't begun yet, though, so that gives you some time to train before it does. He can try, but even if Chavo had a year to train, I'd beat him with both hands tied behind my back. I'm not saying you're a bad trainer, Chavo. It's just you don't have what it takes to beat me. This is interesting. Taking a look at both your Pokedexes, and the results show that Senior Joe has seen 60 different Pokemon, and Chavo has seen 127 Pokemon! Remember, it's not about catching them, it's just about seeing them. Alright, I beat Senior Joe. Mm. And Senior Joe has caught more Pokemon than Charvo. Oh. Looks like I caught more than you did, Charvo. On your journeys, you each captured different Pokemon. With your different personalities, you learn to care for and understand them in different ways. My research has taught me that we need to deal with Pokemon like we deal with people as individuals. That's why I became a Pokemon researcher. Not only does every Pokemon I care for become a part of my research, but they also become part of myself. I inject Pokemon DNA. I spend so much time with the Pokemon you trainers from Pallet Town send me, they become an important part of my life. Hello? That explosion came from the Pokemon Corral out the back. We'd better check it out. What's a Corral? What is that? Something's happening at the Oak Corral. Better check it out. Oh, I was just going to try and run. I'm going. Oh, I've got to go this way. St game, please. There we go. Oh, Christ. Ha! We followed you here so we could steal your Pikachu. We're through... ...messing around, so hand over that rat and make it snappy. A talking Meowth. Incredible! Now hand over that Pikachu and any other Pokemon you got stashed there, or you'll have to battle us. Well, looks like we're doing it. Boop, 
Right. Uh, okay, Victory Bell's gone up a couple of levels since last time. Body Slam! Okay, 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 okay. We're gonna go. Oh, we're gonna be level seventy soon. That's sad, isn't it? Hydro pup. Here comes wet boy. Keep doing that one. That's the powerful one. We got plenty of them. Oh. No, I can't do it yet. I want to be level 69 for a little longer. I should have. I went to press A. Don't wrap me. Thunder. Music. No! No, I didn't even get to say goodbye to the level 69. <laughs> 639, there's level 56, Palmusek. Right, we need to get Palmusek to level 69 then, it's decided. Right, what have you got to say for yourselves? We lost the showdown! You always lose the showdown! It's not a surprise. Why can't good things happen to bad people? We're blasting off again! I'm gonna head on home now. This has been a long day, but I'll see you at the Pokemon League, Charvo. You just better make sure you train as hard as I do. See you then, Charvo. Well, Charvo, you have a lot of training to do before the Pokemon League starts. I'll be sure to let you know when the tournament's begun. You know, if you want to do me a favour, maybe you could head to Seafoam Islands east of here. I've been trying to understand how Slowpoke evolves into Slow Bro. You can talk to Professor West Westwood Fallback, the creator of the Pokedex for me. Tim Westwood invented Pokedexes. I'm sure he could enlighten you to the evolution solution. <laughs> Just follow the Pallet River South. Thanks, Chavo. Oh, it's a river now, is it? You good. You good, bud. Seal, seal. I seem to remember. Was there a Scyther in here somewhere? There's a Palmusek. This place is just bloody... <gasps> no, there was a wet boy. That was it, wasn't it? We had an explorer here in the first episode. Hey, look. Someone's child is wandering around. Can someone... Can someone take responsibility for this human child that's wandering around, please? Yeah, yeah, it's Tim Westwood. Time to talk about the Pokedex, sir. I don't want to fight anyone in here. However, it is 6 p.m., and you know what that means. It is time for Almost a Pair and Big Dick Boy. I'm just going to do a little save. By which I mean Big Dick B, but you know, we're friends, so that's how that works. I will be back in just a second. I hope you enjoy this video. Check the mic and make sure it sound right, boys. Sound right, boy.
Does it sound right, boy? Did it sound right, boy? I, I can only assume that it sounded right, boy. There we are. Yes, of course, triplejump.gg, as it says right there. You in the UK or Europe and for some reason not America? The, uh, elbows, will you please? Just stop hitting things. Then you can buy digital currencies and subscriptions for various PlayStation and Xbox and Nintendo things and mine coins. There we are. We all learned, didn't we? You know, they say all men are created equal. Let's get back to it. Let's go find Westwood. Bra bra raft. Now would be a good time to use a rapple. A rapple. Right. Does he does he even have any fighting type moves? No. So that's pointless, isn't it? Guided hands, thank you for the resub. Two months. On my way to a year. We'll be here, guided hands. Looking forward to having you along on the journey. Thank you so much for the resub. That was a pointless move. Not move. Item. Do not need... Ooh, quit. Is that Seafoam Islands? That's looted. Are you... Are you Westwood? You're not Westwood, are you? Ooh. This has got to be it. There he is. Yo, yo, who have we here? So you're friends of Professor Oak, eh? Please don't call me Professor. It's much too formal. My friends and associates all call me Westwood the Fifth. <laughs> what? I'm a fifth generation Westwood, so you can see that I come from a long line of Pokemon researchers. At the moment, I'm solving a real life mystery slowly but surely. I want to discover why Shelda attaches to Slowpoke to cause it to evolve into Slowbro. I've been researching with my Slowpoke, you may have seen it fishing on the beach. If I can understand why Slowpoke evolves into slow bro, I'll have earned the right to call myself a Westwood. Ooh. Fall back! Solo Quetzal, 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 thank you very much for the resub. 27 months, keep up the good work, Richard. I'll do my best. So, do you want me to... Westwood, would... yeah! Westwood, would you like me to go um, talk to your Slowpoke? Whatever it is, then. I think that's what it wants me to do. Hello? What's up? I'm Westwood Slowpoke. I'm assuming there's just there's something on this island that I've got to do, probably. Oh, hello. And <gasps> Pika. Who's in here then? Oh, is this his house? I'm gonna sleep in your bed. There must be something else to do in the lab. Are these the Westwoods? Oh, look at all the Westwoods. Westwood the second? Where's the, show me the first Westwood, the real Westwood. No, that's Westwood. No, that's that it's all complicated words and numbers that make no sense. Okay, that's not useful either. Where is he? Yo, yo! It's Tim Westwood in one of these. Complicated words, blah, blah, blah. Do I just talk to him again? I'm sure I could understand the mystery of Slowpoke's evolution if I could just witness it firsthand. But for that to happen, a shelter would... Okay, right, gotta go get a shelter. Mm -mm. Okay, let's go get a shelter. I'm eating fake chicken meat in the shape of dinosaurs. This is the future. That is the future. Can I have some? Come on, share. Share. Where's my superb rod? Doo -doo 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 -doo. <gasps> Got a bite! Not even a nibble! Our Pokemon's on the hook. They changed it. Ah! Crabby, go away! Not even a nibble. Not even a nibble. Not even a nibble. Whoa! It's a Crabby. We'll go here. This will change everything. Pokemon's on the hook. It's a shelter. 
Superb Roderick, exactly. Hypnosis. What am I doing? I'm trying to throw a Pokeball. I picked up a great ball, didn't I? Wow, that's a great ball. Yes! Right, this shelter is a write-off because it's about to bite a slowpoke's ass, but we are going to name it. Perhaps name it appropriately. No rude words, no offensive terms. The way we do this, as I explain every time. Lord Brotovich, you see him there in the chat. Are you ready, Lord Brotovich, by the way? Can you confirm that for me? Uh, as soon as Lord Brotovich says go... Put your suggested name underneath. The first one that appears underneath that, for me, might be different for you, but for me, will be chosen as the name. That's how we do it. Lord Rotovich, whenever you're ready, feel free to type go. Get ready, gang. A couple of people jumping the gun there. Trialing Badger straight in there with Trubbish. This shelter is going to be named Trubbish, and it's going to be a bottom Pokemon, just as it deserves to be. The worst Pokemon gets the worst job. Trubbish. There we are. Hey, bud. Would you like to release Shelder to Westwood, the fifth Slowpoke? Yes. Bite it in the bottom. It's sleeping, though, but I'm sure it'll work. It instantly clapped onto Slowpoke's tail. Oh, amazing. Slowpoke and Shelder evolved into Slowbro. There, there they are. Doesn't look like a Shelder. Well, there you go. Westwood. I hope that was enough. Yo, yo, yo. Yo, Chavo. I saw the whole incident from my window. Slowpoke evolved into slow bro when you introduced Shelder to it. Don't you know? Seeing it in person made me understand so much more clearly. The reason Shelder and Slowpoke bond with each other is because it's mutually beneficial. Fall back! It allows Slowpoke to stand upright and use powerful moves like the Mega Punch. And it allows, it allows Shelder to travel on land. Thank you, Chavo. This is a monumental discovery. As my thanks, please have this rare scale. Wow. Is that it? When I present my findings about Slowbro to the Pokemon Symposium, I'll go down as the most renowned researcher in history. Fall back! Can I teleport back or do I have to, to walk? But swim back! Probably. No, no, swim. Please don't look up. Ooh. No, no, no. Oh, beans. You're going to die, Nora. Oh, wow, powerful boys. You got some powerful boys over here, Nora. Girls. Mama, don't screech at me. I'll use water gun. How embarrassing. You died to water gun. Cedra, more like dead. Cloister. Sleep. Protected itself. Okay, body slam. What about body slam? What, a, what about body slam? What about body slam? The Pikachu on the island is episode 69. Thank you, Rory. <sighs> Gotta go back. No, 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 no. Please don't look down. No, no. Do, 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 do. Pika. Hello? Pika. Can I do something in the house now? Funk Soul Brother, check it out now. Just someone Chavo's never seen before. Yeah, of course, it's not your house. 
I've never seen these people before. Nine minutes until 4.20, everybody. What do you want me to do, Pikachu? Can I do anything to help? Pikachu? Do, 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 do. Current is too rough. The raft is careening out of control. The raft can't hold Charvo out of the water any longer. Charvo lost corn. Ch oh my god, Charvo drowned. I had to die. I had to actually die for that that bit. This is my cabin. How are you, kid? Are you hurt? My name's Victor. I saw you struggling in the harsh waves, so I rushed out on my surfboard to help you. But don't thank me. Thank my Pikachu, Puka. I've had Puka for almost 20 years now, but I didn't catch it like you would a regular Pokemon. Puka came to me from the sea. I found it afloat on a piece of wood, and from that day on, Puka and I have never been apart. There's something special about Puka. It can feel the waves in its body. It can sense when a big wave is headed our way. Over the last 20 years, we've surfed every big wave that's come our way. But we're waiting for the big wave. Humunga Dunga. <laughs> come on. This is episode 69. There we go, everyone. Episode 69 of the anime. And it's time to... It's time to tackle Humunga Dunga. It only comes once every 20 years. When I was just a boy, the best surfer I knew was Jan, and he managed to surf Humunga Dunga and place his flag at the peak of the ocean's mountain and become a legend. What did that sentence even mean? I started surfing because I wanted to be just like him. 20 years later, I challenged the big wave. But hu the big wave. But Humunga Dunga beat me, and it was the biggest disappointment of my life. I never wanted to surf again, that is, until I found Puka. If it weren't for Puka, I don't know where or what I'd be. Since then, Puka and I have teamed up and conquered every kind of wave you can imagine. This is, you know that meme of Limmy where he's just woken up and he's looking, he's looking over from the pillow like, like that. That's what Chavo's going through right now. He's just woken up from drowning. And this guy's like, let me tell you about Humunga Dunga and Puka the Pikachu and all the different ways that we've been we've been together for 20 years. There's just one left. Humunga Dunga. Please, I just want to rest. Victor, I need to rest. It's time. Humunga Dunga is coming. It's a wave that only comes every 20 years. Puka and I have to say, all right, just please go away. Please go away. We're fine now. I want to see Humunga Dunga though. Oh, there's the ocean mountain. Humunga Dunga is approaching. Victor and Puka are going to challenge it. Oh my goodness. Oh, they did it. Victor planted his flag on the mountaintop alongside Jans. Is that it? Is he still out there? Is he back in the house? That was rad. That was... Oh, there you are. Hello. Puka and I finally accomplished our lifelong dream. So how's about a battle to see just how good a trainer you are? All right, mate. You saved me from drowning earlier. Now you'll see that Puka's no ordinary Pikachu. It's actually a machine gun in a onesie. It's Swimmer Victor. A level 60 pal Musek. Yeah. Holy... Ball. Stunt. JT the Destroyer, thank you for the blips. Stunt. Right, this could go very badly. Hypnosis. Oh, it's gone badly. Please use quick attack. Okay, we're all right. Rain dance, really? Oh, it's a Pikachu that knows surf, I'm assuming, right? Because it's the one that does the, the surfing. That's why it's no ordinary Pikachu. And that it's really flipping powerful. Please go to sleep. Oh, dear. Okay, okay, okay. Do, do. Yeah, rain begins to fall. Body slam. Right, okay, never mind. That was all for naught, wasn't it? I should have just jumped on it. Tactics? Have you tried jumping on it? <sighs> Damn it, my boy. There wasn't a lot of XP for that. Not too bad, kid. 
You're a pretty strong trainer. You remind me a lot of myself and Puka when I was a kid. Whatever happens, and no matter how many defeats you may face, remember never to give up. It's taken me 40 years to accomplish my dream, but it was well worth the sacrifice. You can do it too, with Can Do. Pika! Right, let's do a save. Do a save, doing a save. Doing a save. Has he even asked if we're okay? No, nope. not even once. What a rude boy boy. Boo, doo -doo -doo. Where has that game gone? I've lost it. Uh, there it is. Okay, where to now? We're going back to Pallet? Please go the door. Or can we keep going to the right? Can we drown again? That's what I really want to know. Uh, uh oh. Oh, we can. <gasps> What's down here, eh? No, no, flipping tentacle. Where are we? This looks new. Is it? Is it new, though? Do a little heal. Right. What's going on here then, hello? Hey, you there. Let's have a match unless you're afraid to lose. Oh, why is everyone so confrontational? It's Pokemon trainer Raymond. That's a big party. And those aren't Gen 1 Pokemons. Who do you think you are? Water gun. Do, do, do. It's a wet boy, it's a wet boy, it's a wet boy. I mean, that is, but who wants one of those, eh? <laughs> oh, body slam! Are we doing the movie now? Is this, is this the movie? Here comes wet boy. Da -da. Pokemon the movie 2000 is that is that what it's called Pokemon the movie 2000 or is that a different one One minute until 420 everybody until the sex number get ready to blaze it Two thousand is the second movie. Pokemon the first movie is the first movie. That's a dead Machamp. Ha! Mm -hmm. <laughs> Gollum. Forgot you had another one. Right, just get yeah. out of here. We're done. We're done. It's four twenty time once again, my dudes. And today, this blazing is brought to you by today's sponsor, Portal Zaras. Do you ever wonder what service was able to teleport Mychenko back to his home planet? Well, we're the ones that did it. We can take anyone true, anywhere actually. across the galaxy. I can fly. Ranging from the planet Pop Star from Kirby to the planet of Gaia from Final Fantasy VII. If you book your teleportation today with the code Mychenko, you'll get 10 light year miles. You will. Yeah. That is true. Happy 420 BBBB Blazed, my dude's Lord 16 Dab. I was inspired by last week's cave action, so here are some cave jokes for you. Mm -hmm. Who is the ruler of the caves? The Spiel und King. Ha ha ha. The Spiel und What sort of music did cavemen listen to? Hard rock. Hi e. What pants do you wear in a cave? Stalactites. Ho ho ho. What do you call a caveman who takes forever to get anywhere? A Neanderthal. Ha ooh ooh. Why can't you open a bar in a cave? You can't serve alcohol to minors. Hi, who? Moggy escape rope. Yeah. Blaze it, my dudes. The final time for Deke my chinko. Blaze it, everybody. It is 420. It is the sex number. I hope you're all blazing at home. Literally. 
or metaphorically. Thank you, Stephen. Thank you, Jack. Thank you, Lord Brotovich. Very, very much indeed. Blaze it, everyone. Oh, I've just managed to... Go away. Windows updated and now it's telling me the weather. I know it's raining. It's England. Oh, no. Do, 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 do. Petition to get Billy R. Walrus into the next Pokemon game. That's a great idea, Jack. Oh, hello. There goes flipping Dragonite. The Dragonite has something for you. It's a video hologram message of a young woman. She is beginning to speak. Greetings, Pokemon trainer. I bear an invitation. You have been chosen to join a select group of Pokemon trainers at a special gathering. It will be hosted by my master, the world's greatest Pokemon trainer at his palace on New Island. A chartered fairy... Fair... A what? A chartered what? That's not right. Board Steve, thank you for the resub. 22 months. Sub... No Ben stream on Friday. This is the this is the stream from this bedroom, shall we say, for this week. Ben will be returning next week. A chartered fairy. Yeah. It is 420 again also as well. Believe in yourself. You are you are stronger and more capable than you give yourself credit for. Oh, some kind of dip, thank you. For the for the blips there and also the the nice message at the end. But good lord, the You nearly broke robot lady there. She didn't really know what day it was. Uh, a chartered linear will leave from Old Shore Wharf to take you to the island this afternoon. Only trainers who present this invitation will be admitted. If you decide to attend, you must decide at once. My master awaits you. There is a note asking if you would like to attend. How do you want to respond? Yeah, yeah. Receive the Neo ticket. Bye, Dragonite. Boing. Bo oh, no. Off you go. Wow, amazing. That's raining, look. Oh, flipping it. It's so atmospheric. There's Old Shore Wharf. We've made it. Let's do a little, little yeah. heal up. Hi, Wall response DM and the war criminal of our hearts, Danny Mysinko. Late into night, have we caught a rubbish for Janet yet? Yep. Just about to pump some iron so one day I can have guns as big as Deeks. Keep trying, board Steve. Keep trying. Thank you for the blips. Uh, yes, we did catch a uh, rubbish, and then we put it on a slow, a slow pokes arse, where it belongs. There we are. Uh, the nurse isn't here. Oi, where's the nurse? Can you operate the machinery? Can I hop over and just do it? Because I need to heal my boys. I need to heal my Pokemon, but the nurse isn't anywhere to be found. Brilliant. So now I've got to go find this flipping nurse. Where, she Where is she? I'm going to own... I'm going to own this supposed Pokemon master. How could I pass up an invitation to meet the greatest Pokemon trainer in the world? Yeah, you brought an Oddish with you. There's nothing I can do about the linear being cancelled. Oh, the fairy was cancelled. This could be the worst storm ever. A deadly storm like this happened long ago, killing all humans who braved the ocean. Legend says that in their sorrow, the water of the Pokemon's tears somehow restored the lives lost in the storm. There'll be a foreshadowing there. But tears aren't going to save you if you try to venture into this storm now. If you try that, and your Pokemon got hurt, you'd be out of luck, because the Pokemon Center's been closed. The nurse in charge of the Center disappeared last month. If you see her, please let me know. Well, God, where is... Well, I don't know where she is. She's not here. There are very few directions I can even go in. This is such a small place. It's just, it's just him. He's the only guy here. Nothing. Can I swim? Oh, okay. Well, we can... Uh-oh. It's immediately gone wrong. Chavo's raft was splintered to pieces. Chavo was consumed by the weight. We're right next to the... Just climb out. Oh, no, guys. We're underwater. Chavo grabbed onto the back of Wet Boy and began to swim. <gasps> Just like the film. Wet boy coming through with the clutch save as always. Oh, there are Pokemon in here. 
This is cool. Look at the water effect. It's a star you. No, no. No, no. No, 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 no. I feel like Palmusek should really have a run out here and just, just get some levels done. Right, let's... Uh... Oh, there's the item. Oh, a Cedra! I mean, if we didn't have like a thousand wet, wet boys already, then... Maybe it would have been tempting. But what's this? Oh, Pearl. Great. So glad I... Oh my god. Can you not? Can you just leave me alone? Can you? Just let me swim in peace. Humans are not meant to be down here. Just give me some space, man. Hello? What's up here? I'm just going to fast forward through this. We'll go up some levels at the same time. That's fine. Yeah. Oh, a little baby horsey. Kill it. Another one. Dead. Stupid duck. Is there a way out? Oh, another bloody water stone. Of course there is, eh? Oh, there it is. There's the way out. <gasps> Chavo pulled himself up out of the water. My master bids you welcome to New Island. Will you kindly present your invitation? Chavo flashed the Neo ticket. Very well, you may enter. Hmm? No, I'm not the missing nurse. I've always dwelt on this on this island. <laughs> and have always been in the service of my master. Please enter. I don't, I don't want to enter. It's spooky here. The door shut and locked behind Chavo. Oh, another one of these. This game... This fan mod loves doing this. It's just making a room too big for you to comfortably see the edges. It's really annoying. It makes you just have to... Oh, there's a Ben's boy there. Oh, look at all these amazing... Po Can I have this one? Can I have this one? Can I have this one? <gasps> scythe, Scythe. Hey, guys. How are we all doing? Cool Pokemon we've all got. Look at all these Pokemon and women. And others. So what are we doing here, eh? What took you so long? It was a breeze for me. I rode here on my Peugeot. So come on, let's have a battle and see how strong we are before his master trainer... I think you mean this master trainer shows. Okay. I don't know what's happening. If you've got bird Pokemon, you're screwed, my dude. Oh no. Tis I who is screwed. Although, we've got a special Pikachu, you can just use Thunderbolt on everything, so let's just do that, I suppose. <laughs> if we're going to fight all these guys, we've got to speed this along. Sorry, Peugeot. Good night. Hitmonlee, good night. Whoa. Hitmonlee? I said, good day, sir. <gasps> Ben's boy, no. <laughs> Raggy dolls, raggy dolls, dolls like you and me. Raggy dolls, raggy dolls made imperfectly. So if you've got a bump on your nose or lamp on your toes, do not despair. Be like the raggy dolls and say, I just don't care. Richard. Why are you quoting raggy dolls at me, man? How dare you? Thank you for the donation, but let's just leave Raggy Dolls at grandparents, okay? That's that's a grandma VHS. That's a bargain bin VHS. Don't need to bring Raggy Dolls into it, okay? If you're unfamiliar with Raggy Dolls, feel free to, feel free to Google it. You won't enjoy what you find, though. Okay, moving on. Flipping Raggy Dolls. Right, back to killing. Oh no, back to killing. Big old thunder. Do, 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 do. I'm alright, Jake. Hope you're doing well. Um, <laughs> Hope you're doing well! Thunder, is this going to do anything for us? Probably not. Ooh, come on, son. Just burn through it. Just get him done, then we can heal up your boy. Blown away! Or maybe you shouldn't have picked a fight with a big boy legend like me, eh? Maybe you should have just thought about it for a minute. 
That was quite a battle. I hope this master trainer is as much of a challenge as you were. Well, I, I, I don't think you do, because you'll just die, mate. Are you going to heal my boys? Can you heal my boys? Now that you yeah. are here... How dare you slag off Raggy Dolls, Deke? I'm glad you're going back to your home planet soon. A fight me board, Steve. If Raggy Dolls are so good, then why why can you only watch them on bargain bin VHSs, eh? Answer me that. Now that you are here, all trainers worthy of an audience with my master are present. Only the trainers capable of braving the storm have proven themselves worthy in my master's eyes. The others have died. I was hoping she would heal me up, so I feel like I've accidentally skipped the other optional battles, which is a shame. Please release your Pokemon from their Pokeballs and join the others. It will not be long before my master's intentions are clear. Chavo released his Pokemon. Why you got a purple Venusaur though? And where's Wet Boy? Is Wet Boy in the pool? Where's Wet Boy? Where is Wet Boy? Wet Boy? Bigar. A blast stoice. Venusaur. If your Pokemon are weak, I can heal them for you if you like. Well, yeah, that's what I wanted the oh, whole time. Okay. I'm not the nurse, though. You may mingle with the other trainers until my master has arrived. So, yeah, okay. What? I haven't released them at all. What are you doing? What? 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 Who else wants a fight? You? It was no problem getting through that storm for me. I rode over on Gyarados's back. Come on, let's have a battle to warm up for this master trainer. <laughs> Sorry, Board Steve. I can only apologise that you had to grow up with Raggy Dolls. Oh, can you imagine? Flipping heck. Raggy Dolls. <laughs> Grotesque. Right, Thunderbolt. Just, Cedra, just die. Don't waste my time like that. It's Collector Fergus. Right. Thunderum. <gasps> the Queen! She is here! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't hurt me. I hurt you. Level 58. Yes. Pamusek really just smashing through. Gyarados. More like dead dose. Ha <laughs> ha Garrod dead. Vaporeon. Oh, Vaporeon gone. Bye. Absolutely. Cannot stand a chance. Gyarados are tough to train, but once you do, it's the most dependable Pokemon there is, whatever you say. Yours is dead, so... Dun, dun, dun. You haven't met my Pokemon yet, have you? Allow me to introduce you. Wabam! And they're all dead. When will they learn? When will you learn? It's Parasol Lady Nisha. She's got a wiggly tough. And I've got a big, powerful Palmuse. Oh my god, the negative image of Wigglytuff is not something I wanted to see again. Thank you. Bye, buddy. <laughs> you big clown. Nine tails. That sounds like a job for w -w -w wet boy. Water gun. Ah, what the hell? How dare you? Hey, 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 don't be doing that. Ah, oh, bloody file boy. Bamboozled. By Parasol Lady Nisha, no less. Body slam! Well, a lot of fire types in here. That's fine. We can deal with that. Dugong? Yes, Palmusek. Get back in there. Thunderbolt. Blastoise. <laughs> Bye. Nincompoops. A lot of them.
Goodbye. That storm wasn't easy to navigate, but it was worth it to meet a Pokemon master. You are already in the presence of greatness. You don't need to meet this master. If you Pokemon a week, I can do yes, thank you. Right, is that everyone? Have I beaten everyone yet? Oh! You are about to meet my master. The time has come for you to for your encounter with the greatest Pokemon master on Earth. Oh, there he is! Yes, the world's greatest Pokemon master is also the most powerful Pokemon on Earth. This is the ruler of New Island, and soon the whole world. Mewtwo. There he is, there's your boy. Be quiet. From now on, I am the one who makes the rules. I am the new ruler of this world, the master of humans and Pokemon alike. You humans are a dangerous species. You brought me into your world with no purpose but to be your slave. But now, I have my own purpose. My storm will create my own world by destroying yours. You, nor your Pokemon, will be spared. They have disgraced themselves by serving humans. Your Pokemon are nothing but slaves. Humans and Pokemon can never be friends. I can never be conquered. My powers are too great. None of you can beat best beat best beat me as a trainer. You got a 25 at best at beat. Me. They say all men are, created, say all equal. Men are created equal, but you look at me. If you are a Pokemon, then there's no reason I can't capture you. Go, Rhyhorn. Oh, there goes Rhyhorn. Oh, flippin' egg, there goes Rhyhorn. Fools, your Pokemon attacks cannot weaken me. My powers are too great. No trainer can conquer me. So, you dare to challenge me to a match? Very well. Like most Pokemon trainers, I too began with Charmander, Squirtle and Bulbot. Did you? You trained Pokemon? So are you any better than the humans that you criticise? Mewtwo? But for their evolved forms, I used their genetic material to clone even more powerful copies. Let me show you just how powerful my clones are. I want to fight you, I don't want to fight your clones. All your Pokemon seem pumped up. Oh, all your Pokemon seem pumped up to battle. Okay. That wasn't it. Oh, look at his weird model. Pokemon trainer Mewtwo would like to battle. Ethically compromised, exactly. Here comes Venusaur. If only I had a fire Pokemon. Level 74. God, okay. Here's one of those difficulty spikes uh, this game likes to throw at you. I don't know if this is one I'm meant to lose or not, so we'll just do our best, I suppose. Quick attack. Flip. What is that? What are you doing? What are you, what are you, what are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, okay. Well, that's fine then. That's not cheating at all. Oh, power music, please. Uh, uh, wet boy. This has got to be a story loss, right? Yeah. I mean, come on. Don't you take in sunlight. Don't you hit me with solar beam. Goodbye, Palmusek. <laughs> Cat Dealy, you wanna You wanna do something? Double edge. Stop giving yourself sun. So you can use solar beam over and over again. I know what your game is. That's not good, is it? And here comes solar beam. And, yeah. And uh, double edge. Uh, yeah, there we go. And there goes Cat Dealy. This is not good. Uh, grass clock. Go on. Fight fire with fire, so to speak. Sleep powder? Wow, that's an overpowered thing, isn't it? You just heal all your health. Tackle. That's the only move I can do that... Okay. Go on. Stop using synthesis! You're a cheater. You're a dirty cheater. Filthy cheaty Pokemon. Right. Wet boy. Hypnosis. <laughs> <laughs> Gone. No, right, here comes Solar Beam. Hypnosis. Synthesis. Stop with the synthesis, man. 
Come on, wet boy. Take down one of them at least. Come on. Stop using it. Yes, okay. I pressed the button. Right, we got one. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. We got him. Come on, please use Charizard. Blastoise. No, if only we had a... If only we had an electric Pokemon ready to go. Well, we're going to use Revive now. Come on. Revival Herb. Palmusek, we need you, bud. Don't you do it. Bite. So come on, two moves in a row. Come on, two moves in a row. Two moves in a row. Really, Blastoise? You're going to do that? Goodbye, Blastoise. Nope, we're good. Do a little bit of damage to him. Not much. Come on, just keep doing it. All the bites. All the bites. All the small things. Come on. Damn the third, you served us well, and I'm proud of you, Pam Muset. Go. Come on. Thunder is potentially going to miss. Thunderbolt, just do it. Come on. Okay, wet boy. It's up to you, my dude. Right. Come on. We've got this. Come on. Oh, don't be using your non-fire moves on me. Okay, that's fine. Come on, wet boy. Oh, it's moving very slowly. Oh, wet boy, come on. Oh, that's a big, powerful move. That's a wet boy. That's why we love the wet boy. It's come home, everybody. It's a day late, but it came home. Take that, Mewtwo, you big, arrogant idiot. This is not possible. Uh, <laughs> have you met Wet Boy? Uh, I will extract your Pokemon's DNA to make clones for myself. They will remain safe on this island with me while my storm destroys the planet. These are my Pokemon. Do not attempt to defy me. This is my world now. Oh my god. Hey, it's fine. You can take those guys. Run, pal, Musek. Wet Boy's not even there, so I'm fine with Wet Boy. Run, pal, Musek, run! Oh no, he's escaping the ball. It's at the bottom of the screen. No! <gasps> pal, Musek cannot be tamed. Mewtwo's not even trying to get Wet Boy because he knows that he can't. No! Pal, Musek was captured by the po a Pokeball. Really? Pal, Musek, really? By a Pokeball. What was that? What just opened? Hello? Can you heal my... You cannot compete with my master. It is futile to try. Human, you have served your... Served my purpose, even. I am sparing your life for the moment. But you cannot escape your fate. The hour of my vengeance draws near. You already had your vengeance. You just nicked all my Pokemon. There's the... There's the Pokey hole there. So have I... Come on. Yeah, I've got no Pokemon left. Have we still got that crap drawing that Todd did, the photo? Wow, so good, Todd. Thank you. Now we, we've got something to remember them by. That's not right. None of these people seem asked that they've lost their Pokemon, and that's okay. Into the hole. Oh my goodness. Are we going to be cloned? <gasps> we got him. Pikachu! Chavo reclaimed all his Pokemon from the cloning machine. The clones have all escaped! Um, where? Oh, they've gone out. They've gone out through the hole in the wall! You can't do this! I won't let you! Oh, here he comes. Oh, look at him. He's got all his mates. No, they're not friends. They're leaving. They're walking away from him. It's not going to end like this, Mewtwo! We won't let it. Oh no, look. The clones are fighting the real ones. Blah, 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 blah. 
Seal's having a great time, though. Or Dugong. Just chilling out. <laughs> keys, keys. Cat Dealer doesn't have anyone to fight. Do I have my Pokemon? Yeah, I do have my Pokemon. Uh, Blastoise doesn't have anyone to fight. <gasps> the Scythers. What? What happened? I must have been under some sort of psychic control by Mewtwo. Yeah. Worse than a Bond villain letting you live. What, taking all my Pokemon away? My precious Pokemon. Thank you, Silent Cop, for the blips. This is wrong. Pokemon are meant to fight each... A po po <laughs> That's one hell of a typo, isn't it? This is wrong. Pokemon are meant to fight each other like this. I wish there was something we could do. These Pokemon look like they're ready to fight to the death. It is useless to challenge me. Oh. We've got to keep challenging him. <gasps> Can it be? Mew? There is the little pink baby. So finally we meet. I may have been cloned from your DNA, but now I will prove that Mewtwo is better than the original, superior to Mew. This world is too small for the two of us. Oh god, look at them go. Bang, bang! Bang, bang! Stop! <gasps> no. Chavo was turned completely to stone. Fool! Trying to stop our battle! <gasps> Pika! Uh, I mean, Pow Moo Pow! Pamusek is trying to shock Chavo back to life. All of the Pokemon are moved by Chavo's sacrifice. Their tears are swirling around Chavo and restoring him to life. Chavo was restored to life by the Pokemon's tears. Well, that's it. Full of there. Job done, eh? He's back. The human sacrificed himself to save the Pokemon. I pitted them against each other. But not until they set aside their differences did I see the true power they all share deep inside. I see now that the circumstances of one's birth are irrelevant. It is what you do with the gift of life that determines who you are. Unless you're born extremely wealthy, in which case it's, com it's just a different set of rules entirely, isn't it? Let's be honest. I will now go where my heart can learn what yours knows so well. What transpired here, I will always remember, but perhaps for you, these events are best forgotten. Chavo's memory of Mewtwo and its clones was erased. Wow, can't wait to go on my cruise. With all my buddies. Wait. Why is, why are they all unconscious and why is Wet Boy a higher level than before? That's weird. Incredible! That fierce storm lifted as quickly as it appeared. It's so good to have things clear again. Ferry to New Island is running. Would you like to go to New Island? That's where we just were, right? Oh. Okay, well, I'm gonna go... Oh, flip it out! There goes Mew! Bye! <laughs> there it goes. I'm just gonna go heal my, heal my boys. Hmm... <laughs> we hope to see you again. Right, what am I meant to do now? Do I do I do I go to new 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 island, whatever the hell it was? Yes, let's go. Might as well. All right, all aboard. Oh, this is different. Can I? I can't climb it still. So this this island is pointless. This is a pointless island. And now I don't really know where to go or what to do. We've hit a dead end. Something of a dead end. So can I swim? No. So let's head back, I suppose. Wow, what a lovely island. Thank you for having me so much. Really enjoyed it. Maybe uh, Professor Oak's going to give us a ring now. So we can challenge the Pokemon League, perhaps? 
But Charbo doesn't... That's too strong to swim. You... Oh, no, we can use the Pokemon Center to warp, can't we? All right, we'll do that. Charvo never wins, by which I mean Ash. He never wins the Pokemon League, does he? He only did it last year in the anime, I think. So it just seems like if we're going to the Pokemon League, we're just we know we're going to lose. So yes, I would like to walk to Pallet. Thank you, Mother, Father. Oh, Charvo, I'm glad I caught you. Since you're not doing any training, I thought you could help me with some chores around the house. Hmm. You do have a lot of training to do before the Pokemon League begins. Maybe if you put your Pokemon to work around the house, it would toughen them up. I don't, I don't know that that's how it works. Well, if you're sure you have training to do... Still, could you do me a favour, Chavo? Would you go to the Xanadu Nursery in Viridian City and pick up some fertiliser for me? I'm building a bomb. Thank you, Chavo. Okay, Mum. Bye, Dad. See you later. Looks like we're going to the Xanadu... The, the Xana Dooby Dooby Doo. So let's go and Xana do that. Oh, I should have used a flipping repel. Whoa! Nyom. Go away. I'm... Oh, oh, stop. Stop it. I'm really busy. I must fetch the fertilizer. I could have also warped. Lots of things that I'm now realising. So, Xanadu is level 70. There we go. Getting there. How many episodes does this cover? I've got the website bookmarked. Maybe it tells me that. No, no. There's the nursery. Let's have a look. Oh! Oh my god! He's meant to be dead! How is he alive? That doesn't make any sense. <clears throat> Let's have a quick look at this. Uh, no, 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 no. Rocket edition. Did I even bookmark it? It's a Twitch command, isn't it? ROM? Yeah, there we go. Let's have a look. How many episodes does it cover? Your name is Ash Ketchum and you're about to embark on your big Pokemon adventure. You're about to embark on an adventure of 116 events. Plus two movie events. So we've done one movie. And we're 70 episodes in. So we're most of the way through now, aren't we? Uh, it ends after the Pokemon the Movie 2000 Orange Islands. And yeah, okay. Well, let's forge ahead then, shall we? Let's do that. What are you doing here? Sorry, that's my best impression of, of Ben. My name's Potter, and I work in this nursery. Sorry. <clears throat> A lot of trainers visit because their grass-type Pokemon love it. Feel free to come in and visit, especially if you have a grass Pokemon. Was that accurate? I think that was close. A lot of trainers vis visist. A lot of trainers resist Xanadu because their grass Pokemon love it. Feel free to let your Pokemon explore. Oh, what is this? The sign indicates this is a rare plant. Want to let grass clo clock smell it? Yeah, go on, smell it. Huh? Something's wrong with glass grass clock. <laughs> Stop! Don't smell that plant. That's a poison Barbara. Oh my God, Ben and Barbara are in here. It badly poisons anyone who smells it. Quickly, bring your Pokemon into my house. Come back. Right, can I just use... Can I just use an antidote, though? I've been down this road before. It's not the end of the world. Do I have any? Yep. It's, it's actually fine. It's actually fine. You don't need to... My gloom can help cure your Pokemon's poison. Okay, well, you can, you can try. Gloom, gloom. Gloom seems to be offering its nectar to your Pokemon. Would you like Grass Clock to smell it? Your Pokemon was completely healed of its poison by Gloom's nectar. It seems very appreciative of Gloom's help. <gasps> Smiley face. I can smell it? Flip and smell it? 
It's a good thing it's been tending the poison Barbara in the nursery for so long. It's built up a strong resistance to it and developed a natural antidote. The Xanadu nursery's been in my family for generations and now they need me to run it. But I'm a big failure at raising Pokemon. I can't even help my Gloom evolve into Vileplume. If I can't do that, how will I ever be able to run a huge nursery? I even bought a leaf stone from a guy who wore his hair kind of long and a girl with big hair and a Meowth that knew how to talk. Huh? You say those three are from Team Rocket, known Pokemon criminals? Then the leaf stone must be a fake. No wonder Gloom didn't evolve. But then, I was wondering, do you think you would battle my Gloom so I could test how strong it really is? I'll do you one better. I've got a leaf stone I'm not going to use. You can just take it. I don't want it. Now we'll see what kind of trainer I am. Don't get your hopes up. I'm very good. I'm very good at Pokemon training, so... You're flipping screwed, mate. Aroma Lady Florinda. Na na na, thunder. Shouldn't work, but it does for some reason. Da da da, thunder. Oh, okay, I see how it is. We really need a fire Pokemon, don't we? Slam! Your Gloom's pretty powerful, to be fair. It's just not as good as my Palmusek. Which is fast and strong and handsome. So. Oh, sorry, Florinda. Oh, what an amazing battle! Charbo, before you came, I didn't think I could do very much of anything, but you helped me believe in myself. Now I feel ready to run this nursery for my family, if one, sp if one special guy is there to share it with me. Oh, Florinda, you'll find someone. I only hope Potter feels the same way about me that I do about him. Oh, that's so nice. Charvo, I know you came to pick up some fertilizer. Please, take this free of charge as my thanks for your help. You're welcome. I can get. Do you want the leaf stone? I I have a leaf stone for you. Do you want it? Potter and I are in love with each other and are going to run this nursery together. Thank you so much for everything, Charvo. So that's where Ben's been. Been off running a fli flipping nursery, is he? I'm not a turn this for this because all right, Potter. Enough from you, you idiot. Let's teleport before we forget that we can do that. I say we. You. Before you forget that you can do that. I'm going to save it. Just before I forget. No, 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 no. Warp. Wow, I was lucky I pressed that too quick. I ended up going to the right place anyway. Hey, Mum. Hey, Dad. I got you big stinky bomb fuel. Oh, Chavo, thank you for picking up the fertilizer. I want to use it to plant berries in the front yard. I'll be tending to them often, so feel free to stop and see how they're growing. When they're ripe, I'll pick some for you. Thank you, Charvo. Father, good to see you. Okay, so that is done. Should we go see Prof Oak? See if he's got anything to say? I don't know that he will, but we can try. Ooh, doo -doo -doo. He's not even here. Professor Oak, where... Oh, okay, there he is. Chavo, I was just thinking how fond I was getting of your Pokemon. I wouldn't mind if you left one here with me to keep me company for a time. It could only benefit you of... It would only benefit you, of course. I promise it will get plenty of experience while you're away. How about it? Yes. Oh, he's just gone on to something else. I don't care, I don't care. I'm going to go give you the crap Charmeleon. Does that sound good? Do you have a PC in here? Of course you flipping don't. Why would you? You're already a Pokemon professor. Excuse me. Excuse me. Whoa, whoa. There are the berries. Nothing in there yet. Leave Charmeleon. I'm gonna. Same wavelength. Get rid of the worst one. And, um, just got a reminder on my phone to put on a wash. Got to wash those clothes, you know. This tank top. My war outfit. Uh, oh no, I can't. Can I not access bar? I can't even access Pokemon storage here. Flipping egg. No, I don't want to walk there. Why would I want... Viridian, go. My PC. Oak's Lab. Oak's Lab! 
It's called Oak's Lab, and when you go to Oak's Lab, you can't even access your... <laughs> Come on! Goodbye, boring loner. I would say it's been a pleasure to have you watching me over the last month, but we both know that'd be a lie, wouldn't we? <laughs> I'm sure Ben will be pleased to see you, though. I will tell him that you said that he's boring, though, so... You know, have fun dealing with that mess. Um... Provoke! I have a gift for you! Yes, take my worst one. Fine, I'll look after your rain time for a while. Come see me in a while. Right, well, we are going to call it there for today. I have absolutely no idea where I'm expected to go next. But there we go. We'll do a save. And we will leave it right there. Save. There we go. And back to face cam. There we are. Thank you so much, everybody, for watching not only today, but over the past month. It's been a pleasure to be here. Um, there is no joint stream this week. Uh, what else is there? Brian is yeah. doing his final stream tomorrow. Cheers for the streams over the past month, Deke. It's been so much fun and we all love you, my dude. Take care. Don't lie, Stephen. I'm a very divisive figure. But thank you for the blips. I appreciate the kind words. Uh, plenty coming out this week. Lists and, and a couple of standalone videos as well that you want to keep an eye out for. And uh, yeah, I want to thank you for... You know, being kind to me and welcoming over the last month. It's been, it's genuinely yeah. been terrible. It's been fun. <laughs> Mr. Black, thank you very much. We're going to go raid Cultaholic now. Go and wave hello to, I think, Andrew is streaming. Go send your love. And I will catch you all. Never. I hate you all. Bye, everybody. Hate you. Bye. Uh...